Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I have a bomb haul, meaning black owned makeup brand haul. So your girl has been shopping again and I've been picking up stuff from some black owned companies. So if you're interested in seeing what companies and what products I picked up, stay tuned and keep watching. Okay, so the first company that I wanna talk about is TonyDaily.com. This is a Canadian YouTuber, um, and she also has wigs, hair, accessories, and jewelry, and I picked up a set of earrings from her. I bought some for my daughter, and then I also bought a pair for myself. So these are the earrings. Aren't they so cute? They say classy, bougie, ratchet, and I wore these in my, um, I think my haul, my collective haul video. I have them on there and I think I have them on in my Mac tutorial, all Mac tutorial video. So you can see them on me there and I really, really like them. And she is a Canadian YouTuber so I'm supporting a fellow black Canadian YouTuber, so yeah, so check her out. I'll leave the link to everything down in the description section. Okay, so the next product I picked up was from Range Beauty and it's their foundation. Um, this is a True Intention Hi True Intentions Hydrating Foundation. And I um, heard about this company from Glam Girl Chelsea and then um, Behind the Beauty had the owner. Um, in one of their episodes here on YouTube. And this is the color choo, 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 Rio. So this is in the color Rio. Um, what I did was I went on their site and I ordered four sample sizes. They were $2 each. And this was the closest match to my complexion. So then I went ahead and ordered the full size. And this is a hydrating foundation free of talc, paraben, fragrance, phthalates, and synthetic dyes. So I follow Corey G Indianapolis here on YouTube and she recently started her company. And this is it, Corey G Indianapolis, and I will leave a link to her channel. I'll probably insert it in the video or leave a link in the description box. And she recently started her um, makeup line, and she's another small YouTuber here, and she's doing her thing. So I think her packaging has changed since I bought the stuff, because I think now most of her packaging is like this logo here, the pink and gold, but I have it in just solid colors. So the first thing I picked up was her blush palette, and look at this. This is so pretty, and you know how I love blush. So these are the colors. Look at that, y'all. Stop it. I am so excited about this blush palette, and I can't wait to use them love it and she also has a setting powder and this is the H hd tinted powder in the color medium and this is the packaging i don't know if it's gonna pick up the color yeah so it has a little tint to it so i can't wait to try that out i haven't tried out anything i've just been ordering stuff and it's been taking weeks like weeks up to eight weeks to come in from different brands, but I've just been patient and just waiting for it. But I got pretty much everything in now, so that's why I'm doing the haul. So I cannot wait to put these things to use, especially this blush palette. And then, of course, you know I'm an eyeshadow fanatic, so I ordered her eyeshadow palette, and I think it's called Midwest Sass, because Indianapolis, I guess, is in the Midwest. And this is what it looks like. I haven't even swatched it. Look at that. So I think it's an even um, mix of cool and warm tones. I gotta swatch something. I just, I just have to. Let's see here. So that's that brown, which will be a beautiful transition color. They swatch nicely. And of course, you know I love me a glitter. So I gotta swatch one of the glitters. Oh, this one's like a duochrome. So I swatch this one here, and then this pink duochrome glitter there. 
Let's see if I can get you guys to see it. Do you guys see that duochrome? It's like a goldy green shift. There we go. I'm not gonna swatch everything because I have a lot of stuff to show you guys, but I just had to swatch it. Because Cannot wait to use them. And her brand is vegan and cruelty free. She did a video on when she introduced her products and she did a um, tutorial using them. And she went into more details on um, the whole idea behind her brand and what she wanted and she definitely wanted it to be vegan and cruelty free the next place that i ordered from was juvia's place now i know juvia's place has been around for a while but i didn't pick up anything from juvia's place um shipping to canada sometimes you have to worry about duty and stuff like that and i was worried about what especially ordering all of this i was worried about what i would have to pay duty on but so far i didn't have to pay duty on anything so now i'll start ordering from these places more so i picked up a few eyeshadow palettes the first one i picked up was the masquerade mini and these are not new new palettes at all these are just new to me and again i didn't even swatch these so this is the masquerade mini okay i'm going into this color up here this blue called called zola because you know me and these shimmers Ooh, stop it and then i'm gonna go into this cairo which is like a brownie color with like it's like a matte with some gold shimmer in it i just want to see if it picks up so the gold shimmer doesn't pick up that much and then i will go into this purple zobo and that's what those colors look like now there's a ton of videos on youtube using this palette and juvia place palettes in general but there's none by me so you guys are going to see some looks coming with that the next one that i picked up which this was the one that made me decide i wanted to place the order and this is the juvia's place nubian three coral palette and i just love corals so i wanted this palette and i i thought the color story was really interesting like corals and silvers and grays like i have nothing like this in my collection and i just thought that this was just a neat color story what do you guys think i want to swatch this gray here this metallic silver <gasps> And let's swatch one of these corals. You know I'm going for the metallics because that is my life. I love metallics on my eyes. Do you guys see that? So excited. So excited. The next palette. Okay, I'm not going to swatch so much because we're going to be here forever. The next palette I picked up was the Zulu palette. And this one is hella colorful. And that's why I picked it up. Because I wanted more color in my life. So this is the Zulu palette. I don't want my lights to wash it out. There we go. That's better. That's more of a true representation of the colors. Okay, I'm going to just swatch one shade from this palette. Let's swatch this metallic green. You guys, I'm in heaven. I so happy. And the last palette that I picked up from Juvia's place was the Warrior Warrior 2. And this is a all matte palette, which you know I'm not an all matte girl, but I think the colors in here are staples. Look at that. There are some beautiful transition colors. This one has a black in it. I don't think any of the other palettes that I got had a black in it. And that's why that was one of the reasons too. I always like a palette with a black because I'm always trying to find the best black. Um, yeah, but I think this is just a staple palette to have in your collection. 
Okay, so the next company that I ordered from was the Lip Bar. And from what I understand, in the States, the Lip Bar is sold in Target. So we don't have the Lip Bar here in Canada at all because we don't have a Target in Canada. So I ordered a few things and um, let's go over them. So I ordered the Fast Face Kit that came with like everything to do a full face. So the first thing that I got in that kit was this highlighter, blush, face, and contour palette. And this is in, I think the kit that I got was the cinnamon kit for 400. So this is what the palette looks like. And of course I swatched this one. This one, I just wanted to swatch. So it has the blush, it has the contour, it has a face powder and a highlighter. And then in that kit, we also got a foundation and I got 402, does this have a color? Or is, there, is that just a shade? So this is a skin serum foundation with hyaluronic acid and Irish moss extract. And that's what it looks like. And this comes with a brush, which I find is very neat. And then the kit came with this lipstick. This is Boss Lady. And it is their liquid matte. And this is what it looks like. And let's give this a swatch. Ooh. So that's what Boss Lady looks like swatched. It's not, it hasn't dried down yet, but it is a matte lipstick. So the next thing that came in the kit was the two-in-one brow gel and pencil. So this end here has the pencil and it's a slanted brow pencil. And then the other end has the brow gel. And I also got a straight line matte eyeliner. It's just in black. So that was everything that came in the fast face kit. And then I ordered some extra stuff. So I wanted to give their glosses a try because I am a gloss girl. So I picked up the color, what is this? Miss Independent, which is a nude. Of course I got a nude. And this is what it looks like. Let's give that a swatch. Ooh, that's a beautiful nude. So this is the lip gloss in Miss Independent and that's the Boss Lady drying down. And then I got two lipsticks. So I got a nude called Goals and I got a red called Cosmo. So Goals is a shimmer shade. I thought this would be nice to put in the center of a lipstick. And then the other one is a red called Cosmo. And this is the red. And that's Cosmo over there. And then I also got a travel bag that I could put everything in. I think this was part of the kit. And the kit also came with a brush, but of course, due to COVID, the brush is shipping separately. I don't know when I'm gonna get it, but that's what the brush looks like. And they gave a free lipstick gift for, you know, not having the brush. And that one is in chocolate spritz, and that's what it looks like. So, no, the free lipstick that they gave me was Gold's, and the lipstick that I bought was chocolate spritz. So that one there is chocolate spritz. So yeah, so I think I was thinking about getting golds, but I settled on chocolate spritz and then I still got golds as a free gift for the inconvenience of not getting the brush at the same time, but I will wait patiently. Oh, and I forgot one more thing from the Fast Face Kit. I also got a mascara. This is the Lash Flash 
strengthening mascara with green tea extract. And I think that's everything now that I got from the lip bar. So that's the mascara. The next set of things that I picked up were from Makeup by Tammy, who is a YouTuber here. And this is the card, Makeup by Tammy. Um, she is in the UK. And let me tell you, this took a while to come, but it's here. It just came today. Thank God, because I was gonna film the video without it, but it came today. And I got some lashes by her. Um, so I got four pairs. This first pair is called Mia. And that's what Mia looks like. You know what, let me take it out of this packaging. Um, the first one that I was showing you guys is Mia. And this is what Mia looks like. So they're light and long, which I think I will like. The next style that I picked up are Tony. And these are what Tony looks like. Those are a lot fuller and more dramatic. Those look amazing. The next style I picked up is Girlies. These are nice and long. I don't think they're as thick as Tony, the style Tony, but those look gorgeous. And I love how they're tapered in the middle and then get longer. Those are my favorite style of lashes. And then Nicole, and Nicole is um, longer in the middle. So that's Nicole. And those are so beautiful. And Makeup by Tammy did a collaboration with Makeup Revolution. And we finally have Makeup Revolution here in Canada. And I found her um, Tropics, the Tropical Carnival Shadow Palette. This thing is so beautiful. I haven't tried it, I haven't swatched it, but I'm so glad that I picked it up. And that's what it looks like. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for all this color? So it comes with a huge mirror. And then this is the palette. Look at that. I am so excited. I am so excited, like, you know I love me. A green eye look. Did you guys check out my Natasha Denona eye look? I'm just saying, it's a green eye look, but look at these greens and blues and purples and it's just the tropics and I love the names. There's like Calypso, Soka, you know, St. Catherine. I wonder um, if, there's a, if this is based on the carnival in Trinidad. Is there a St. Catherine in Trinidad? There's a St. Catherine in Jamaica. Girlies, Bacchanal, um, tr oh, Trini. So this is probably based on the carnival that happens in Trinidad and Tobago. Right. So I know that Revolution Makeup is not black owned, but I'm supporting Tammy, who is a black YouTuber and a businesswoman, because she does have a website, makeupbytammy.com. I'll link everything in the description box. And the last company that I ordered products from is from Propa Beauty. I know some people pronounce it Propa or something. I'm Jamaican, and in Jamaica we say everything Propa, meaning everything is right, everything is good. <laughs> So I'm gonna call it proper beauty, okay? And I got four lipsticks, which I'm going to do a tutorial and do like a lip swatch of these, but I will show you the lipsticks. So this is the packaging, which is really neat and simple. And then this one is called Closer. So this is what Closer looks like. Focus, there we go. So that's Closer. I will do a quick swatch. That's the swatch for closer there. And again, I will try all of these on in an upcoming video. The next one is called Her Magic. And this is what Her Magic looks like. Her Magic is definitely more of a warmer brown than closer, which is more cool tone. The next one I picked up was Victress, and Victress is lighter. There's Victress, so this is what Victress looks like. And here is the swatch. So that's Victress, 
her magic and close. And the last one is Driven. And Driven is the, I think the darkest one I got. There we go. So that's um, Driven. So yeah, I'm excited to use these lipsticks in a upcoming video. Um, and I think, I think that's it. So that wraps up my black owned makeup brand haul. I am so excited to play in these products. I am going to do some bomb makeup tutorials coming your way. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thumbs up the video if you love hauls and until next time. Bye guys.